famous everywhere you say I'm gonna make Good morning. Hello, Cinderella. Good morning. Good to see you. How are you today? Okay, so today, good morning, Chica. Good to have you this morning. How are you today? Let me just adjust my camera a bit closer to me all right how we doing hello Ezra <laughs> hello again Ezra good to have you hello Chimelem good to have you Emmanuel Stephen good morning hello how are my lovely kids the kids are fine thank you Amaka good morning Maureen Frezia good morning Choma, good morning. How are we doing this morning? How is everyone? I hope you're fine. What am I doing? Okay, you'll know about that shortly. I hope we are doing well this morning. Hello, Tots. Good to have you. Hello, Bas Basuki. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Wherever you are this time of the day, I am Christiana Stephen. Hello, Eva. And hello, Foul. Good to have you. All right, today we'll go straight to breakfast. What are we having today? I'm going to be working with this um, vegetable avocado. Hello, Amine. Hello, Chichi from Phil. Good to have you. Hello. All right, I'm going to be having this. Um, this is my vegetable for the day avocado is very 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 nice and healthy as well okay bas basuki says is evening good evening so wherever you are is either morning afternoon evening or night so let's say good morning good afternoon good evening and good night oh my favorite my hope is very thank you hello maureen all right so today is avocado day this is my vegetable for today i kind of like um avocado raza i am fine and how are you too i kind of love avocado a lot because it's really healthy it has a way of lowering your bad cholesterol hello stella hello melis good to have you has it has a way of lowering your cholesterol level and meanwhile next monday i think that will be on the 23rd of august we're going to start our seven day breakfast i'm um, sorry smoothie challenge so it's going to be for seven days no chewing everything you're going to have is smoothie breakfast lunch dinner it's a healthy challenge if you're interested there's a link there's a whatsapp link on this um video after the show, I will be taking off the WhatsApp link. Hello, Mitoke, you're good. Good to know. Hello, Andre. Good afternoon, Andre. Hello, Mia. Good to see you. And hello, God bless you. Oh, thanks so much, um, Laksh Lakshma. Good to have you. All right, if you're just joining my show, I'm Christiana Steven. Kindly share this video. I know a lot of you have been sharing this my videos, but please share this particular video Share it. It's very important to me. All right. So back to avocado What are we having avocado? I'm going to do two types of um, smoothie breakfast with avocado as my um, Vegetable for today. Hello Rini from Poland. Good to have you um ho 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 ta sorry alexandra sorry if i get your name um pronounced wrongly i apologize all right so i'm christiana and this is what we are having today so the first um smoothie i'll be making 
is a power pack smoothie i always love power pack smoothies because for me if you're having breakfast it should be filling enough to take you through up till you have your lunch so breakfast should be quite rich so i'll be using avocado <laughs> stella says hurry i'm starving okay i'm gonna be fast with it hi sis from Cambodia. good to have you hello nancy you're cool good luck thank you so much thank you thank you everyone all right so i'll use avocado the avocado is already um diced out so what i'm using in this particular smoothie that i'll be doing is half of this avocado it's quite big isn't it it's quite big so it's going to be filling all right so i'm going to use it i've diced half into here already and i'm going to use mango so i have um, a cup of mango in here hello vincentia from ghana hello madina too good to have you hello funke good morning from nigeria good to have you thanks reza i appreciate thanks um daniela yeah you can help me come and help me <laughs> okay so this is mango so i'll use um avocado mango this is one cup of mango if you want to try you can try it it's going to come out really nice so half avocado one cup of mango and then i'm going to use a handful of parsley somehow i love vegetables a lot i'm going to use a handful of parsley so this is my parsley leaves already washed and i'm going to use a quarter of cucumber so i've already washed the cucumber and i've diced the cucumber out these are the things i'm going to be using for this um, particular smoothie and also i'll add um, a scoop of protein powder yeah i'll add a scoop of protein powder normally i always do raw eggs but if you can't find pasteurized um eggs then don't worry about eggs you can just substitute with protein powder here all right so yeah there we go first of all as usual we're gonna do our vegetables first hello um nikma from malaysia good to have you hello amara good to have you good morning mary good to see you all right so i'm gonna start with my vegetables i always like blending my vegetables first of all before any other thing is blended so i'm putting in my parsley leaves a handful of it and my quarter of cucumber in here what else am i doing all right so somehow i stumbled into this um this milk this is oat milk i've actually been looking for it so i got into a store yesterday and i found it yeah it's out it's from our pro so it's oat milk i'm going to be using um a glass of it I'm from Cambodia. <laughs> All right, thanks. Welcome, welcome, Winifred. Good morning, um, my guy from Nigeria. Good to have you. All right, so I'll be using this as my fluid or my liquid for this two smoothie breakfast. All right, smoothie breakfast or breakfast smoothie, whichever one. All right, so my vegetables are here. I'm not going to add this first. I'll just let the parsley and the cucumber blend first of all with my milk. So I'll take So it says a glass of this is about 45 calories. I'm not going to use a full glass. And I love using small glasses because it keeps me in my border. <laughs> I, don't like, I don't use big glasses to measure milk. All right. So I've put it in here now. Where is 
that okay and I'm, go I'm going to blend the vegetables first of all thanks so much love you too all right see you next time okay i'm gonna blend this now rain tea from indonesia good to have you all right so i've blended my vegetable i'm going to add avocado because the avocado would blend quite first so i'll just add it here And then I'll add my mango. So that's a cup of mango. All right, Ran Rathana, good to have you. And have a good day as well. Hello, Christy. My name is Christiana Steven. All right, so I've added my mango to it. And then I'll just take a scoop of this. It has a scoop inside it. So that's the scoop in here. And so this scoop is about 30 grams. So I'm going to measure out 20 grams. That's too much. Yeah, so I'll add 20 grams. Let's see what we get from this smoothie today. So like I say, if you want to use, um, if you want to join, um, what's it called? The WhatsApp group. The WhatsApp group is free. It's just for seven days. So we are having our, what's it called? Um, seven day smoothie challenge. The WhatsApp link is up there. Feel free to join the group. We are starting on the 23rd of August. That's next week, Monday. It's going to be seven days of clean eating, smoothie. So we'll be having vegetables, um, fruits, nuts, seeds in our smoothies. All right, so I'll blend this for the last time. Okay, let me read comments. Oh yeah, <laughs> thank you so much. Oh yeah, I appreciate um, Maria Peters. Hello, dog. Well done. Thank you so much. All right, so this is ready. I hope. So I'll just transfer it here. Let's see if we would get into this glass. I'll transfer it here. So that's it.
so now this is a full breakfast you have almost everything you need in this breakfast it's just that sometimes we get used to chewing so if we don't chew we feel like awkward like we have to chew something we feel a bit awkward so people try to avoid breakfast like this but this is a very healthy way of starting your day so we have in here just to recap we have half avocado um, a cup of mango parsley a handful of parsley leaves and um, what else did I add here can someone even remind me all right then I have um like half cup of um, oats milk and um, a quarter of cucumber I'm just cutting my eyes and looking at the ingredients I use all right please share this video please all right so smoothie one is ready we'll move on to the second smoothie still using avocado meanwhile if you haven't taken your tea make sure you have your lemon tea I've spoken about this a lot this helps me a lot in fact this period of my life I've been feeling so bloated it's not that I'm not eating healthy but you know that season of the of the year in a woman's life where you're bloated so I've been feeling it so bloated and this has really helped me so if you're going through any kind of blotting this is a very good way to help yourself morning and night all right our second smoothie for the day oh all right amara thanks to i appreciate please share the video thank you adenike i appreciate hello you carry good to have you all right so our second breakfast smoothie i'm going to use different things but i'll be using avocado as my most not most but as my vegetable for today so in here i've got half of avocado so it's already sliced and it's here half of it and then i have a quarter of cucumber as well just almost the same thing um hello ivan hello ebere good to have you hello nora good morning mommy v good to see you hello i'm watching from malaysia thank you for sharing this wow it's very nice thanks selena thank you so much for joining in from malaysia all right so there's avocado in here half avocado there's um a quarter of cucumber i get to forget names of vegetables a lot and then i'm gonna use something slightly different there's um broccoli here this broccoli is a very very good source of protein yeah so if you're looking for something that can give you good protein broccoli is very good so i just have a handful of broccoli here and then for my fruits so those are three vegetables the vegetables here are avocado cucumber and broccoli and the fruits i'm going to be using here i have strawberry and banana so the strawberries i have about eight pieces of strawberries and one banana that's another kind of smoothie seal with avocado so just to show you how to play around with avocado avocado is quite healthy you can play around it in a number of ways all right back to my tea before i get into that one all right i'll start blending with my vegetables first blend that first I'll use I'll still use the milk hi hi <laughs> I'll use that as usual, this is my oat milk. Today, I've decided that I'm going to use this. Uh, 
Um, yeah, Nora, you can use all milk if you want, but you need to be careful with the um, fat content and how you use it. I use all milk for my children, but I've never really taken whole milk for myself i always tend to go towards tiger nut milk almond milk coconut milk what else what other milk have i tried okay now i'm trying oat milk i've tried rice milk as well all right so let's blend it Just wrap this so because we're not ready for it now just to protect it so this is wrapped Samson you haven't missed anything Hello, Jody. Um, okay, Rachel. All right, so yeah, I've blended the broccoli and cucumber in here. So I'm just adding the avocado. All right, so I have my banana and what else? Strawberries in here. One banana and strawberries. Hello, Favor. Good morning. So I didn't get to use eight of the um, strawberries. I've decided to use four instead of eight. All right, it's time to blend again. So this is ready now. Good morning, Maria. Oops, oops. Okay, um, Lillian, don't worry. I'll talk about blotting shortly because I feel terribly bloated for no reason. Like for no reason, I eat really healthy all the things and yet i still feel bloated you know as a woman we really i think we really can't run away <laughs> from it all right so this is ready now i'm going to recap on what is in here 
and then I would address all the questions. All right. <laughs> Christy says I'm drinking my morning ritual. <laughs> all right. So for please share this video. Kindly share this video. All right. This is my morning ritual. I tend to talk about it a lot of times because it's really like it's been very helpful it has worked for me over and over and over i say like i say having this um about a year ago but what i usually do is i take it for three months discontinue then take it another three months so that's what i do i don't get to take it continually for one year though to be fair to me <laughs> all right so what is in here is a lemon sliced um oh i didn't add cinnamon but usually lemon sliced ginger sliced a teaspoon of um apple cider um a teaspoon of honey hot water i could add a stick of cinnamon that's it i have videos of different teas on this page please look through it if you need like something to help you out for blotting there are different types of teas that you can play around with and they are all homemade teas they are not teas that i get to buy outside so i make them at home and it's a good way to know what you're drinking um all right hey dear welcome all right andre all right that's it about it so i'll just recap about these smoothies that i've made about the smoothie my first smoothie this is the first smoothie i made this morning using avocado so just showing us how to play around with our vegetable this is a very important healthy vegetable all right so in here i have half avocado and um, half avocado what did i put here again oh a handful of parsley a quarter of cucumber please try and remember because my head is a cup of half a cup of oat milk what else i'm just scanning my eyes yeah i think that's what i put in here yeah and a scoop of protein powder that's what i put in here then for this one i used half avocado um quarter of a handful of broccoli quarter of cucumber in my oats milk i added banana one banana and just four strawberries so that's the second smoothie all right ayomi okay let's see so chioma says please i have ulcer and i normally feel bloated can i take the morning tea chioma what i'll say is it depends on the kind of body you have i have had ulcer i said in fact i was diagnosed of ulcer uh, peptic ulcer when i was 11 and somehow i haven't really had any crisis starting to eat healthy and i've been taking this tea for like a year and i haven't had any effect but again i'll say it depends on your body so talk to your doctor because i might say try it and it causes problem for you so please speak to your doctor if you have health concerns speak to your doctor before you try anything please all right um uh, what else we'll watch later okay yummy okay please take again samson i am new here zz oh luck hello zz hello amy amy all right okay so that's it about the teas i'm going on my um smoothie challenge which is starting on the 23rd of august the link to the whatsapp group is there it's for seven days it's free so feel free to join in immediately after this show i'm taking out the whatsapp link i'm trying to secure us as good as as much as i can let me check how many people have joined the whatsapp group so far 
because what whatsapp does it gives us um room for just 20, 256 people so let me see how many people have joined in already so already there are 73 people in the whatsapp group now so it would be if you're interested in it kindly join in if you're interested in this smoothie um, challenge kindly join in. it's a good way for you to start your healthy lifestyle if you haven't so how do I join the WhatsApp there's a link on this on this video there's a link just look at it there's a link on it that says WhatsApp link click on the link and it will take you straight to the group people are still joining in as I'm talking people are joining people are joining in so feel free to join in wherever you are it's just we're go i'm going to be sending out the recipes i'm going to be sending out the recipes for the seven days feel free to join feel free to also add people who may be interested in it but let me say that this is totally up to you if you can't do it do it if you cannot do it please don't force yourself to do it we all have our abilities i see people who do seven days dry fast and they are perfect but i have tried doing just two days dry fast and i was already half gone so we all have our different abilities if it's something you cannot do please don't do it you saw my youtube there's youtube link and there's whatsapp link as well all right, so finally, today is my mother's and grandmother's birthday. And um, I said I was going to do it at the beginning, but somehow I forgot. This is me wishing my mom a happy birthday and my grandmom a happy birthday. Please feel free to drop in um, birthday messages for my mom and grandmom. My mom would be live to watch it. She's always on my show, but somehow in the mornings she rushes up to work. Please feel free to celebrate my mom and grand mom. They've been um, the most important um, source of my life. They've been very um, significant to me. They've also been my pillar. They're kind of my mentors. So feel free to wish them a happy birthday. Thank you, Jody. Hello, love it. Good to have you. All right, so where are we now? So that's it. If you have questions, Please send in your questions. I have another um, how many minutes to spend on this show. Please send in your questions. I know a lot of people have been asking me questions. So let me go and check my inbox. I've got lots of questions. And I'm sorry if you've sent um, questions and I haven't um, responded to your questions. It's not intentional. It's not intentional. Let me see if there's any question I have to address. Okay, someone is asking, can a pregnant woman go in for this weight loss? No, it's not weight loss. This smoothie challenge. It's not weight loss. It's not weight loss. It's a smoothie challenge, but you will certainly lose weight. Can a pregnant woman do it? I would say you talk to your health caregiver, whoever is taking care of you or nursing you in the pregnancy, Please speak to them about it. Pregnancy is a sensitive period. In fact, I try to avoid dealing with pregnant women as much as I can, not because it's, it's out of my way, but because I feel you're dealing directly with a doctor. It's more sensitive. You are having a baby. A baby, someone is growing inside of you, and one has to be careful what you take in. It's a healthy journey, but I would suggest... When you see the recipes, talk your, um, what's it called, your doctor through it. Show your doctor if it's healthy enough for you and your baby. If, if it isn't, please do not do it. Then for breastfeeding mothers, because I know that's the next question I'll be expecting. For breastfeeding mothers, I would say if you're up to it. If you can do it, do it. If you cannot do it, forget it. And then again, you have to watch your baby while you're doing it. Vegetables, fruits, not seeds are good. But our babies can become sensitive to what we eat. Especially when we are continually or exclusively breastfeeding. Yeah? 
So that's what I'll say about that. Any other, let me check if there's another question. Okay, so that's about that's about the major question I have um I've had to respond to pregnancy breastfeeding. If you're if you're in that category, speak to your doctor. If you're if you're breastfeeding, watch your child while you're doing anything, especially if you're breastfeeding exclusively. Please share this video. Kindly share this video. We get to share a lot of things online. Please just share it. Share it. Share me to the world share me to your community all right that's about it any other question let me go through the comments and see if i'm omitting because people always say i omit questions i don't respond to them it's not intentional sometimes i don't see the questions on time Hello. okay all right so far i haven't seen any question lillian is asking how do you detox the liver I just see liver is part of your body liver is in your body it's just like asking how do you detox my body liver is inside your body so anything you're taking for detox will detox your entire body so that's what i'll say lillian so you sh the question should be how all these hypes and talks about detoxing the liver there's nothing I still maintain that there's nothing you put through your mouth that doesn't if affect your entire body. So there's no particular drink that you're going to take and say, okay, this is just for liver, that it would influence your entire body. So aim to detox your entire body. Just go in for a seven-day detox. There are different ways to do detox. You can either do a seven-day pure detox or do a three-day detox, depending on you. There are vegetables that you can you can use to detox yourself. I used to do um, seven day um, detox some time ago. I used to like give out the free meal plans, but I want to just focus on what I have from Monday because it's a lot of work to put in. I've been writing the meal plans so that we can have everything we need in our smoothies, our protein, our carbohydrate everything inside our smoothies so for now that's what our advice about detox detox you can buy detox tea I can't recommend anyone because I've I hardly use detox teas I only tend to detox the traditional way whereby I get my vegetables fruit and I detox at home I don't buy tea so I don't even know which one to recommend to you the smoothie you made today, please recap. Oh, tire. Oh, look, tire. Okay, you said I should recap. So, I would have said you should watch this video again if my time was up. But I, I have about three minutes. And after three minutes, I need to go up. So, I'm just going to recap and then end with the recap. But if you haven't shared this video, kindly share the video. If you're looking for a, a link to the whatsapp group it's up there and it's just for seven days it's starting next week monday and it will end on sunday so it's from 23rd and it will get into september so that's it all right for this smoothie i used have avocado please remember it because even myself i'm beginning to forget things as i'm talking half avocado a quarter of um cucumber a handful of parsley uh what else did i use oh, la, 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 la. half cup of oats uh, milk and protein powder so 20 grams of protein powder that's what i use for this smoothie yeah and for this smoothie i used half avocado and i used um, a cup of mango one banana a handful of broccoli four pieces of strawberry and uh, la, 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 half cup of oat milk so that's it about these two smoothies this is what we are having for breakfast not the children though this is myself and my husband so i don't restrict my kids when it comes to i don't i don't do the smoothies 
every time for for them and make them chew all right so that's about it the links are up there thanks so much yeah i wanted to say thanks so much for everyone that has actually subscribed to my youtube channel thumbs up to you there's gonna be a lot i'm working on my different videos there's gonna be a lot there i know some people have gone there nothing is really happened but something is gonna happen pretty soon so when you subscribe to the youtube channel please 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 click the notification button so that you know when i'm actually uploading something hello sister what's the best vegetables for detox i mean the one that works for you the one that works for me is ginger <laughs> ginger turmeric um what else ginger works for me very well when i'm detoxing turmeric works for me well um spinach avo uh, not avocado spinach um kale cucumber parsley leaves I need to sit down and think but the two tops on my head is ginger and turmeric if i want to detox purely ginger and turmeric i tend to like put them on every smoothie i'm taking when i'm de trying to detox and i tend to use them as well to make tea so precious yeah there are a couple of vegetables that i might not remember everything but this one's parsley is very good for me when i'm detoxing um cucumber is good for me when i'm detoxing kale leaves um um spinach what about uh, celery i use celeries uh can i remember yeah that's what i can remember adeni happy birthday to your mom and grandma I'm wishing them many happy thank you so much adenike and then adenike is the only person that has wished my mom and grandma a happy birthday like i said please drop a happy birthday message in this video because my mom will be watching today is her birthday and today is also my grandma's birthday all right thank you so much for watching i'm gonna take out the whatsapp link right after this video so feel free to join right now let's see how many people have joined in let's see how many people have joined in People are still joining in. So right now we have about 85 people. Once we have 200 and 256 people in this group, that's the end because, um, what's it called? Um, WhatsApp allows us only 256, 256 people per group. But if I still have more people, I might have to create two groups. We are starting next week, Monday. Thank you, Samson. I truly appreciate. Thank you, chat, Mr. Deza. All right, ladies and gentlemen, kindly share my video. I am Christiana Steven. Thanks, precious. I don't know. Does, if your number is not saved on my phone, I might not be able to see you on the WhatsApp group. But if you want me to save your number, just pop me a private chat, then I'll save it. Thank you, Christy. Thanks, everyone, for wishing my mom and grandma a happy birthday. I'll make sure my mom watches this video. I'm going to share it on our page. I'm going to share it on our page. I'll make sure she watches it so that she knows that everyone is wishing them well. Thank you so much, love it. Thank you, Chica. Thanks so much for celebrating the two most um, significant women in my life. Thank you so much. I truly appreciate it. They mean a lot to me. That's why I'm talking about it. Thanks and see you tomorrow morning. Yeah, see you same time tomorrow morning.